All right, well, good morning, everybody. Clinton Fawcett here coming to you live from the 2017 ATA show. I'm with Dan McCarthy this morning here at the Black Eagle Arrows booth, and he's going to talk to us about their new products for this year. Uh, this year we, uh, we came out with two new shafts, really. We came out with, for our trad guys, uh, the Instinct. This is actually a pretty pretty popular uh, demographic of shooters. You, I think it's underestimated a lot how big the, the trad guys are, and we wanted to make a new age arrow for traditional guys. You know, just because you shoot traditional doesn't mean you shoot a traditional arrow. So we created a micro diameter shaft. Um, this is a 166 ID shaft, so it's a really small arrow, kind of brings the arrow a little bit closer to the center shot, makes it a little easier to tune. Um, and we incorporated a hardened steel 100 grain outsert with that. So you're able to shoot a little bit lighter broadhead, but still get, you know, 200 grains up front, or if you wanted to shoot, you know, more than that, you're welcome to. But it gives, a, it, you know, it's, it gives a really good, uh, just a good arrow for traditional guys. And it comes in several spines. Um, this is a three inch, three degree offset uh, helical. They come, come and flat hand painted, too. hand painted, hand crested. And our other new arrow that we did this year, this was a PS26 on the target side, so a 2664 shaft. Um, it's been really popular for us. We actually released this like midsummer of last year. Um, we were going to wait till ATA, but we decided it's done, it's ready to go, let's roll it out for the rest of the target season last year, and it's been really good for us. Um, it's just an awesome, bigger diameter target shaft. As far as the rest of the stuff goes, uh, we had a pretty good lineup, and we decided to just keep rolling with what was working. Yeah, so. I, <clears throat> I know we've all been really happy with our arrows since we started shooting them. A lot of us shoot the Rampages or the Renegades. You know, they're great hunting arrows. I know that deep impact. There's some guys that just love that with the with the force. And the, the Vintage Arrow, that looks a lot like that. Yeah. Deep impact arrows fall yep. as far as the weight and the heaviness. Yep, they're very similar. They're they're you know your 1964 shaft and then your smaller shafts, but they're they're really heavy for grains per inch and they give uh, that shooter that wants a lot of momentum to pull through an animal, get a lot of uh, pass throughs and stuff. That's it's a really popular shaft for us. Gotcha. Well, uh, thank. I mean, and the Rampage. You mentioned the Rampage. I've hunted with the Rampage for several years. I love that that shaft with the half out. It seems like it does really good with the stainless steel half out on the front of it. Yep. It seems that like we had great luck with it. We had several pass-throughs. Well, actually, all the deer we shot, we had pass-throughs on with them this year. I mean, that's what a lot of guys, it's their go-to hunting arrow. If yeah. you get online and look around, everybody rages about that yeah, thing. Yeah, it, it's just, it's a, it's a good shaft because, I mean, usually you have two people. You have guys that are obsessed with speed, and then you have guys that are obsessed with penetration, and the rampage kind of falls right in between that. It's going to give even somebody like me it has got a short draw length. I'm going to hit that 400 grain arrow. So if I want to go elk hunting in Idaho or something, I'm legal. I don't have to set up a different arrow that's heavy just to go hunt that stuff. And, it, I mean... And then I just bury it deeper into the ground when I'm hunting whitetails. Right. So it's just a really good all-around hunting arrow. Right. Yeah, like I said, we've been super happy with them. I mean, thanks a lot, Dan, yeah. for giving us the time this morning. Guys, you can check them out at blackeaglearrows.com. Get you some good arrows.